How's it going YouTube? It's RJ here and in today's video we are going to be opening up a uh, pre-release deck box of uh, Unified Minds. So in these pre-release deck boxes you get uh, four packs of the set and the um you get a little mini deck that you can build off of. So these are meant for pre-release events but unfortunately I don't I don't have an option to attend any. But I can go ahead and uh, buy these from GameStop, so I end up doing that for most of the sets. And this is the first time I'm actually opening up any of the Unified Minds set. So you get a little, I believe, a little mini how to play book, if I'm not mistaken, or building tips is what it is, which isn't that bad. Uh, I got the Amoongus deck so let's go and see what's inside of this it comes with a code card i'm not revealing the code cards because i use those for ptcgl and yeah this should be cool so it comes with a uh hollow card then we uh professor's own lecture blues tactics uh, how pokemon communication shroomish breloom uh fungus of course you have to have at least Probably three, yeah. And then another Amoongus. I believe this is a... Uh, they're all from... Is this the Unified Minds set? I don't know. I think, I would assume that was the symbol. Oh, cool. We got a Cynthia from Prism. Karate Belt. Uh, Tauros. Metatite. Multiple of them. And then a couple of Metachams at the end. So an interesting uh, grass fighting deck. Which wouldn't be that good in my opinion uh in the uh tournament if you were to participate in this but that's not for me to decide that is for everyone else to be like yeah you're right because i think what most of those might have had if they were fighting type a psychic like energy it's a psychic weakness which the set is meant to uh be a psychic base set So, here we go. One, two, three. Drop the one, because that's an energy. One, two. And that way we get the, uh, we get a rare in the back. So we have Fletchling, Onyx, Fletchender. Ooh, I'm bad at this. Snowvern, Murkrow, Blizzard Town. Flyam Z Air Slash. Okay, cool. Swadloon, Driftloon, and then a Secret Rare. Awesome. That's crazy. That's crazy. I don't even know if this is good. Uh, if this card is attached to one of your Pokemon, discard it at the end of your opponent's turn. If the Pokemon this card is attached to is your active Pokemon and takes 180 or more damage from an opponent's attack, put 10 damage counter on the attacking Pokemon. Hmm. That's... I don't know if that's good. 10 damage counter. But it's a secret rare. So that's all that matters. We got the best type of card you could get. I don't know if it's a good card. I'll have to look everything up and post. But we ended up pulling a secret rare out of a <laughs> poor pack being crazy. Holy crap. Sorry, it doesn't seem like I'm ecstatic about that, even though I actually am. I just don't really know how to react. Uh, I'm trying my best to keep everything calm and collected as possible. One, two, three, drop the one, boom, one, two. I do like the uh, new style, and I hope you guys are enjoying the daily pack openings because this should be uploaded no, this will probably be uploaded before that. So yeah, I'm doing some daily pack openings. So um, that's going to start very soon. So we got a Bidoof, Cosmog, Magmar, Cottony, Snow Runt, Jinx, Tornadus, Vibarel, uh, Reverse Hone Edge, and then Galvantula, regular rare. So I haven't pulled very many packs since Tag Team was released. I think I bought Tag Team. Elite Trainer Box, and that was basically it. I completely skipped over Unbroken Bonds. 
but that was a, uh, that was just a, uh, not a choice by I don't want to open these sets. It's more like I just didn't have an interest. But with the uh, new set coming out, which uh, already came out, dropped one, one, two, that was a fairy energy. With the new set out, I'm really excited. I'm like super duper excited. I missed out on release day, and of course they sold out. Execute, um, Hunch, Murkrow, Snowburn, Rutini, Sableye, Magneton, uh, Hapu, Reverse Circuitry, and then a Dragonite regular rare. So far, we're probably only on it, on to just get this uh, secret rare, which honestly isn't that bad because I'd rather get a secret rare over just like a regular GX because I can pull a regular GX much you know more commonly than you can a uh, you can get a, a secret rare. But I should be doing daily pack openings uh, for a very long time. Hopefully, that's the game plan. Right, one, two, three, drop the one, lightning energy, one, two. Here we go. Magmar is a common again. Tynamo, skipping past everything. Cosmog, Salandit, Gibble, Fracture, Blues Tactics, Azelf, uncommon, crazy. Yanma, oh, reverse Yanma, I couldn't even tell. And then Licky Licky regular rare. So the only thing we did pull was the secret rare, but the secret rare was the secret rare. So I cannot complain. Let's see how many cars is, are in the set even. 236. Jesus. Wait, hold up. That's 251 out of 236. Jesus, this is a big set. Yeah, this isn't one I'm going to try to ever get a master set of. But yeah, we pulled a secret rare. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy. And like I said, daily pack openings should be coming out. I can't wait. So I will see you guys next time with more Pokemon content. So until then, YouTube, goodbye.